I'm Susan. I hope everybody's doing great today. Today I'm doing a, a crock pot recipe. It is so hot. It is early in the morning and I'm already sweating up a storm. So I'm going to do something that won't heat up the whole kitchen. So it's got, it's called Shep Wreck and it's got um, ground beef and potatoes and tomato soup and kidney beans and Velveeta cheese and all kinds of goodness. So I hope it'll be one my family likes. So without further ado, let's get started. For this recipe, you'll need one pound of ground beef browned. I did add seasonings and I added some garlic. You'll need four to five potatoes cut like french fry strips. One to two onions chopped. This is one large onion. 16 ounces of light kidney bean, light red kidney beans. A fourth a pound of Velveeta cubed. A can of tomato soup. One and a half teaspoons of salt and a fourth a teaspoon of pepper and butter to dot on top. In your crock pot, you want to add your cooked ground beef, spreading it out on the bottom. Layer your potatoes on top of your meat, your onion, your drained kidney beans. Sprinkle your Velveeta over the top of that. Spread out your tomato soup as best as you can over the top of that. Your seasonings. And dot it with butter. It didn't say how much, I just kind of spread a little bit out around it. Now, this is a shipwreck, all right. Not a shipwreck, but a shipwreck. <laughs> and I'm just dotting it with butter. You want to cover your crock pot and cook it on low. It's set six to eight hours. Now, at five hours, it was done. And it looked it looked kind of rough there at first, but once you mixed it, it really was fine and it really tasted good. This was one that my family liked. It was a keeper. So looks aren't everything. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Ring that bell so you can be notified when I upload new content. This was a good hearty meal. So until next time, bye y'all.